Rai yangu ni kwamba wakati umefika tujikite zaidi kwenye kufanya research. Mwani bado haujatambulika vizuri. Research zaidi tuone nini kiko ndani ya mwani au mwani pia uko kwa, uko aina nyingi. Ni kwamba ni aina gani basi labda is the best kutumika kwa mama chakula. Mwani inaweza kutusaidia namna gani kwenye mambo mengine yote na swala zima tunajua la mazingira mwani ni sosia blue carbon kilimo cha mwani zanziba au seaweed in other words mwani is seaweed or simos um, kilimo cha mwani zanziba asilimia tisini ya wakulima wake ni wanawake na vile vile mwani unachangia pato la fedha za kigeni Zanzibar ikiwa ni namba tatu ikifuatiwa na utalii na karafuu lakini vile vile Zanzibar ndio wanaolima mwani mwingi zaidi ya wazalishaji wa mwani wa kwanza barani Afrika lakini pia tutambue duniani kote asilimia saba, saba ya mwani wote unazalishwa Asia the rest of us all tuko within the 3% ambayo Zanzibar inaongoza kwa Afrika kwa hiyo bado tuna nafasi kwa hiyo ni washauri pia wote tuendelee kutumia mwani na tuweze kusaidiana na hawa mama waondokane mwani uwe ni chanzo cha cha fedha kwao lakini mwani uwe pia ndio mkombozi wao katika swala zima la lishe duni Tanzania na duniani kote kwa ujumla and i think we need to talk a lot more about that because we need to transform our food systems we need to transform the food systems of norway we need to transform the food systems of africa and that is a huge opportunity for each of those 33 million small scale farmers that can make a living stepping out of self substance farming and becoming uh, the head of their own their own life and economic independence